blowing cause it's on. Yeah, girl, it's on. This is an artisan news flash for Monday, November 7th. Lil Wayne isn't wasting any time after being released from prison late last week. He hopped up on stage with fellow cash money and young money artist Drake for the tune Miss Me. He also took in a basketball game in New Orleans. Upon his release, former President Bill Clinton said he was a fan of his and thought he could stay out of trouble in the future. Although he didn't go to jail, Kanye West has been vilified, this time by former President George W. Bush. Bush called Kanye's criticism of how he handled the hurricane disaster in New Orleans, saying he didn't care about African Americans, one of the low points in his presidency. Kanye now has up to five covers ready for his new release, My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy, after controversy over the initial artwork, which was a painting of a woman straddling a man. Meanwhile, actress Gwyneth Paltrow will not only sing CeeLo Green's hit F.U. on Glee on November 16th with a tweak to the lyrics, she'll also be singing the standard Singing in the Rain and appropriately Rihanna's Umbrella. Lastly, Jay-Z is set to release Decoded on November 16th. The book is being released page by page in various capacities by Microsoft's search engine Bing. The book not only focuses on his life and is named for a decoding of 36 songs from his catalog.